was out there and I was looking at these big little boxes of white thingamabobbers and I was like, what's going on with these white thingamabobbers? As we look here, the finishers are creating this like archway around the door. This one is square, that one's different material. But if you guys can guess what that arch is made of, you win one dollar. That is styrofoam they're putting around there. Very interesting, and then they're gonna spray it with some texture. Stucco maybe a little bit, who knows. Styrofoam, how about that? <laughs> Cheap construction, ladies and gentlemen, they're putting it all over right here. Man, you move in like a sofa, one bang to it, that thing's gonna be destroyed. Interesting, and now when I was in Brazil, if you guys wanna go back and see a lot of styrofoam construction, go back to my vlog for when I was in Brazil, we see my sister-in-law's new house under construction and they put a lot of styrofoam in that bad boy. On a side note, what do you think of my nice little pillows out there? Check that out. Okay, so let's go ahead and look over this real quick. This we're gonna hang up. Remember, that was a dumpster diving find. Pillows were a dumpster diving find. That little uh, laundry hamper that we have for recycles is a dumpster diving find. This little fountain over here is a dumpster diving find. That table right there is a dumpster diving find. And then, uh, oh yeah, the little hanging plant things over here and right here here that sell at Home Depot for I think 20 or 25 bucks a pop. Those were dumpster diving finds. And then there was something else. I think maybe one of these plants or something like that. I can't really remember off the top of my head. But oh yeah, that broom was a dumpster diving find. How about that? And then we do need to put out again, remember last night we found that beautiful wicker that matches this wicker. How sweet is that? Well, what I'm probably gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and do it without the missus knowing about it because the after effects, she'll love it, but during the process, might not love it. So, you gotta play it smart, guys. You gotta play it smart. Cause it's the most wonderful time of the year. Picking up food at Trader Joe's organic applesauce and coconut water. <laughs> and baby spinach for the green shake smoothies, baby. Kickboxing, 1.31 a.m., we've been back for a while, was actually re-editing the vlog because, well, I slept in because I was like thrashed, like three days of very low sleep. We're talking like four hours a night, which is half the amount. I'm a seven and a half to eight hour to pushing nine per day. I don't necessarily need nine, I'm not Tom Cruise, but I definitely want at least eight hours just to feel like a spring chicken, especially when I train hard. I, my body just needs that time to recoup and replenish. So anyway, we are going to the post office, gonna drop off a box in the back of the car, sold some nice Reebok pump shoes that I found dumpster diving, and we're gonna drop that off. I do not like to waste time in the daytime dropping that off because more traffic, more lights, it's not too far away. But anywho, it gives me an excuse as well. I'm gonna re-hit one complex that doesn't take out their trash on Mondays, so there's always some nice stuff, some of the times. And then we're also gonna go back and hit that brand new complex again where we saw that Ikea coffee table because I'm very intrigued. Plus, we're gonna go ahead and roll some footage that you haven't seen quite yet because I split it up into two days and security just drove by. <laughs> but I'm on a major street. He's probably just going to one of these complexes. Anywho, by the time I get back, he'll be long gone. Say, man, you shipping that box off at the post office? <laughs> oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm, I'm shipping this box to the post office. Be a lot cooler if you did. Well, post office one fail. I guess the box was too light to open up the latch on the other side of the little drop box. Well, that's a bummer. So, let's go ahead and go another five minutes down the street to my original one that never lets me down. Post office, you are a dirty dog. You fail number two. That one is jammed. Oh, boy. Well, the average person would give up, but I'm determined. We got plenty of post offices around where I live, so instead of coming back tomorrow and wasting more time, 
I'm gonna go another five minutes and hopefully that one, third time's a charm. Let's hope for the best. Friends, wish me luck. Here we go, one, two, and three. Oh, please go in. Oh my gosh, it's gone. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my gosh. Always double check, thank you, Jesus. Oh, fantastic, let's go. Onward ho! I hardly doubt that's trash. It's next to a trash can, a <laughs> Razor scooter. How about that, pick it up. No, I'm just kidding, just kidding, leave it there. Coffee table's gone, my friends, but we got a stack of goodies. Let's go up for a closer look. Oh my goodness. Well, that was worth coming all the way over here for when I go to the bathroom. Like, I go to the bathroom real bad. Man, these people are crazy rich around here. Crazy rich. Johnny, where are you going tonight? I'm going to Bala Town. It's called Bala Town Population, me and my purses. Wow, baby. Well, folks, that was definitely worth a detour from all those post offices boxes something or others is. Anywho, let's roll some more footage from last night. Those little wood box things look like closet organization type of items. My wife loves her new ones, but those would have came in handy a little while ago. Yeah, how about that office chair, baby? Looking real good. I go through these times where I find nothing but good furniture and then other times I find electronics with no furniture. Looks like everyone got the memo, let's go ditch our Ikea and get other type of furniture or ditch the good furniture like crate and barrel and get other stuff. What's all this stuff? Look at that, area carpet on top. We got an area carpet on the bottom. Black bag right there. My goodness, there's a lot of furniture tonight. Hey, how about that footage, baby? That's what I'm talking about. We looking real good. We're actually gonna go get the missus some gasoline right now. All that driving around town costs a few pennies. So, with that ado, God bless you, God protect you. Remember to cop my damn baby and live your dream. And as you can tell, always a pleasure when you find a nice little haul. I'll be back there tomorrow for sure. I don't think they're done quite yet. Someone got laced up with a nice coffee table. I hope that went to the right people or the right reseller who needs the cash or just someone who's smart and just took it. Anywho, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Later. <laughs>